50 Cincinnati's hot, hotter than fire. And last night they were hotter than Major League Soccer's Chicago Fire. What a night for FC Cincinnati in front of a national television audience. Local 12's Joe Webb joins us live from Nippert with what's next for the young team. Hi, Joe. Hey, Rob. You know, well, hopefully for a lot of these people, what's next is some sleep. It was a late night here for a lot of the fans and players who shared a really special event at Nippert Stadium. Scoreless tie after regula regulation, two overtimes, settled by penalty kicks. Now, FC, goal FC Cincinnati goalkeeper Mitch Hildebrandt repeatedly said no to Major League Soccer stars last night. Does the performance here mean we're actually getting closer to MLS saying yes to FC Cincinnati? When Mitch said no for the last time Wednesday night, FC Cincinnati had beaten one of Major League Soccer's best teams, 3-1 on penalty kicks. It was a moment for 32,000 in attendance and a national TV audience. One of those moments that means something today might mean even more in hindsight a few years down the road. I'm obviously very proud of our city uh, to promote Cincinnati on a national stage the way we did. Uh, I'm proud of our team, played their hearts out. Just a thrilling sporting event last night, whether you're a soccer fan or not. The fan base is growing. At Cincy Shirts, football and baseball fans were buying new gear today. And I'm excited that Cincinnati has something that they're all together and supporting of. That's what I like. And there was a lot to like Wednesday night. Among other things, Hildebrandt had 10 saves, three in the shootout. Fans are saying yes to his Mitch Says No t-shirt. Mitch Says No is a chant that the pride has in the Bailey, and they chant it whenever he blocks, blocks a shot, and we decided to make a shirt, and everybody's loving it. And now after last night's game, I'm surprised they're still on the shelves. The team, operating on little sleep, was back at Nippert to work out this morning. Mitch Hildebrandt was still saying no. Any point last night did you think you were going to lose? No. Any point last night you really get scared? No. Are you ready for this run to end? No. Mitch says no, but a big yes to what's going on with this team. Yeah, it's been special. Um, obviously, when you can go deep in this competition, it's, uh, it's good for the club, it's good for the city, it's good for the team. Mitch Hildebrandt was kind, he was humble, and he said yes to an interview with only about four hours sleep. He says that FC Cincinnati is an MLS caliber team and that no one really should have been surprised that they won last night. July 12th, they move on to play Miami FC in the quarterfinals of the Lamar Hunt Cup. That game, sadly, not here at Nippert Stadium where they've got a really great home advantage, Rob. That game is actually in Miami. Sure Rob. is fun to see, Joe. Thanks very much. We appreciate it. FC Cincinnati will be back at Nippert Sunday, July 9th for a home game against the Richmond Kickers. You can watch that on Star 64. And if you were out